Hello everyone. I am Dr. Keswar, Associate Professor in Department of Computer Engineering of AISSMS Institute of Information Technology, Pune. Today I am going to discuss STL and its components. Introduction to Standard Template Library. Before going to details of the Standard Template Library, we must know the what is the library. Library means collection of multiple same things. For example, book library means multiple different types of books in a library. Same way here is a different template functions are available and that's why it is called the template library or standard template library. As we know the templates and it is used for the generic programming. And templates are helps the developer by generic programming to support the generic code or generic programming. The standard template library are developed by the Alexander Stepno and Meng Li of the Halliwell Packard HP. And they are Develop for the general purpose temporized classes such as data structures and functions such as algorithms. The collection of these generic classes and generic functions is called the standard template library or in short STL. The STL contain contains several components but at its core are only three components and these three components are containers algorithms and iterators these three components work in conjunction with one another to provide support to a variety of programming solutions what is exactly the relationship between stl components just see the figure. There are container, algorithm, iterator. Container holds the objects, or its name is container, so it holds the objects of the or many objects of the class or program. Algorithm is a different algorithm, maybe searching algorithm, maybe sorting algorithm. Algorithm are used to manipulate the data of the container with the help of iterators. Iterators like a pointer they helps the algorithm to process a manipulation of data as we know the container in details the container is object that holds or that holds the different objects of the same type it is a way data is organized in a memory. The STL containers are implemented by template classes and therefore can be easily customized to hold different types of data. An algorithm in a STL is a procedure that is used to process the data contained in the containers. The STL includes many different kinds of algorithms to provide support to tasks such as initializing, searching, copying, sorting, merging, and so many. Algorithms are implemented by template functions. Then iterators. Iterators is a object or like a pointer or more than pointer that points to an element in a container. We can use iterators to move through the contents of the container with the help of algorithm. Iterators are handled just like a pointer. We can increment or decrement the iterators. There are different types of iterators available. In another lecture, we are going to see the in details of the iterators and its types. Iterators connect algorithm with containers and play a key role in a manipulation or processing of data or store data in a container. Thank you. Happy learning.